under control. Miles is watching Beast, MJ is tracking the Devil's Breath. Time for me to focus on finding Otto and stopping whatever he has. Yuri, we need to start tracking the big boys. Still no leads on Octavius? No, nothing. Forensics can't even do a sweep of Times Square. Everyone in that department but the intern is sick. I might be able to turn something up. Let you know what I find. Stalker guy. You can call me Taskmaster. Because you keep leaving me tasks? That's kinda on the nose. There's a group of mercenaries committing crimes across the city. These mercenaries wouldn't happen to be your mercenaries, would they? No. All I know is they're getting paid well for their work. Unless you stop them, that is. What's in it for you? I get to watch and learn. Spider-Man, here to lend a hand? Thought you might need one, officer. You don't know the half of it. Never seen anything like this Devil's Breath stuff. Forensics is having a hell of a time. News reports say this is where Otto released Devil's Breath. Might have left some residue I can track. to do on this sign. Maybe I can isolate it. AT rich leader sequence. This looks promising. Modified CPF-1. Definitely Devil's Breath. Should be able to track the dispersal path now. Trail goes in a few directions. Need to find the right one. The vapor trail heads up that building! leads down into those vents. What was Otto doing up here? Should be a door or an access hatch around here. Well, this is moody. Must be some way to hit the lights. there be light. Whoa. Was Otto using this as a staging ground? The chaos of the prison break would have been perfect cover to move in. Martin Lee. Can't believe this is the same man I knew at Feast. Seems like Otto and Lee have more of a history than I thought. How long have they known each other?
looks like Otto recorded messages for his crew. Oh, Martin. When I first realized it was you targeting Osborne these past weeks, I was shocked and saddened. But then, as the situation evolved before my eyes, I felt... inspired. You took the bold steps I had always dreamed of, Martin, and you took them without hesitation. I am honored now to join you on this path towards true justice. Otto's rage is driving him. The neural interface is exacerbating it, but his hate is genuine. He'll destroy the whole city to hurt Norman. collects his accolades, and keeps his boot heel pressed against my neck. Why can't anyone else see how selfish he is, how reckless, how evil? If only they could be made to see the Norman I know, the man behind the mask. Looks like Otto's been studying Sable's tech for weaknesses. Good old Rhino, my second favorite Russian. Otto developed a corrosive to free Rhino from his suit. A certain government agency spent years trying and failing to do that. Only took Otto a few days. your career with great interest. The world sees you as a witless dullard. I see a warrior with a poet's heart. I know you desire freedom from the battle suit you're sealed inside. Help me achieve my goals, and freedom shall be yours. Mac Gargan, a.k.a. Scorpion, a.k.a. Crazy Pants McCrazy. It's rare for me to admit this, Mr. Gargan. Clearing your debts was more difficult than I anticipated. You're in arrears to some demanding individuals. But, once the reservoir job is finished, your financial obligations will be finished as well. Otto Octavius is nothing if not persuasive. Old man Vulture. I've tangled with him more than anyone else here. Power source for Vulture's wings gave him spinal cancer, and Otto's developing an experimental treatment to save him. It 
Adrian, what bitter irony that your miraculous wings should have brought such horrors on your body. Thankfully, you are now working for me. When our work is settled, the treatment I've developed will cure you. You won't shuffle off this mortal coil just yet, my friend. Electro. Total live wire, that one. Electro's big pipe dream is to become pure energy. Doc actually managed to modify his harness to get a little closer to that goal. Max, when you first conveyed your dream to me, I thought you insane. Pure energy. <laughs> But as I dove deeper into the problem, I discovered a way to give us both what we desire. I promise you, when we are done, you will be pure energy. Or so close to it as to make the difference irrelevant. What's this now? Otto must have used this map to plan, but it's blank. Unless there's something here I'm missing. UV bulb. Huh, nothing happened. Must be a way to get that lamp on. There we go. Hidden markings. Otto's tasked the villains to destroy Oscorp holdings throughout the city. He's trying to take apart Norman's empire piece by piece. Lee's going after the Devil's Breath Anti-Serum, using something called Icarus? Rhino's targeting Oscorp's shoreline properties. Which is he hitting first? And Scorpion must be trying to poison the city's reservoir. Another Oscorp-owned property. Seems like the last stage of the plan is a direct assault on Oscorp. And most likely, Norman. What's Vulture doing in Times Square? I need to keep my guard up. Electro's disabling Oscorp power plants. Makes sense. Icarus, this is it. Spider-Man. We've never been properly introduced. I'm o Otto Octavius. There is no Icarus, is there? No. Martin needs no assistance to secure the anti-serum. Icarus was a ruse to get you into position. Into position? to work for a man like Octavius. Backup plans for his backup plans. Hey, Pete, are you okay? What's happening? Traffic's rough. Listen, Lee's gunning for the anti-serum. We need to find Oscorp's Devil's Breath Lab before he does. On it right now. Pulling every building permit in the city. If there's a record of the lab, I'll find it. That's great. Okay. Uh, uh, talk soon, MJ! <laughs> <sighs> 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 
trap failed? Softened him up. Time for plan B. Drop his guard first. Stay still! Ah, a bit over-eager there, Electro. Not complaining, mind you. Ah, one thing real quick. Need to catch my breath. Take over, Electro. No problem, Pete! I'm my feelings.
assessing this situation accurately. Electro's been grounded. Spider-Man, I presume. If you really cared about this city, you'd be helping me expose Osborne for the criminal he is. By killing innocent people? I would have restored the power. You're sick. You need help. I have all the help I need. And we will not stop until Norman gets what he deserves. when they team up. Just need to catch my breath. Yuri. Yuri, Vulture and Electro are down. Four to go. I saw. Also noticed a rooftop in Times Square exploded. Wouldn't happen to be related, would it? Nothing gets by you. It was Octavius' staging ground. He's using the villains to pull apart Oscorp. Vulture and Electro were targeting power plants. Scorpion's going after water treatment. Not sure about Rhino yet. Something along the shoreline. That's good enough to start. I assume you're going after Scorpion? Yeah. City's already on the brink. If we lose clean water, we might never come back. I'll update you when I make progress. Sounds like a plan. I should check on Miles. Hey, Pete, you okay? That's what I was gonna ask you. I'm fine. But you and May are in the middle of it. We're busy, but people need help. And I'd rather be doing something than waiting around for somebody else to fix things, you know? Yeah, I heard that. Just make sure you protect yourself. Mask and gloves. And rest every now and then. All that goes double for May. <sighs> Nobody can make that woman take a break when she doesn't want to. But I'll do my best. Thanks, Miles. Give May my love. And be safe. the reservoir. No sign of Scorpion. Better take a closer look. Report of a mugging. Weapon drawn. Need an well, officer on If I was scene. a mercenary dressed like a Scorpion, where would I be? Behind you! Ah. Me, I'd end it now. But Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you. Which I respect. Damn it! What did he inject me with? Whoa! What the... Is that... a sea of poison? Can't be! This can't be real. Must be the poison. But I can't take any chances. 
Gotta get to higher ground and analyze whatever he injected me with. Should be safe for a minute. Need to analyze the neurotoxin so I can create an antidote. Scorpions made some upgrades. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create nightmares that my body thinks are real. I have to create the antidote fast. First, I need a natural steroid. Extract from an Eclipta Alba plant should do the trick. ESU's greenhouse is nearby. Hope it's in season. Eclipta Alba should be inside the greenhouse. There it is. Don't worry. Is that good? It's safe. Where'd it go? Is this real or in my mind? It can be both. Duck? It's just the hallucinations. You can get through this. Doc, you sound... Like I did before the neural interface affected my mind. My obsessions were always there, but the interface allowed me to fully embrace them. I have to fix this. Fix you! Somehow! Ah, uh, Peter. Always trying to shoulder the responsibility. I can't tell you how many times your unfettered optimism has kept me going when things don't bleed. I'll miss me, you. I really will. I'm sorry. There's the Eclipse I need an antitoxin to mix a permanent antidote. One of Harry's research stations was developing a synthetic atropine. Gotta get there fast. Scorpion tails. Lovely. Thanks, brain. How are you feeling, spider? Raw panic crawling up your spine. Scorpion? How'd you get this number? Always asking of these interesting questions. It's not how am I calling you, it's am I calling you. Maybe I'm just the fevered screams of your dying brain. Real or no? When I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac! <laughs> Big talk from the little bug. Have fun chasing pink elephant. There's the research station. We need that atropine. Atropine's right there. Don't worry. Atropine's gone. Not again.
You were too late. Just as you were too late to help me. This isn't you, Doc! Ah, but it is me. The me polite society found me. The parts of myself I suppress. You helped me break those chains. I'm sorry. I'll find a way to help you. I swear it. Stop deluding yourself. You never help anyone. You are the poison. Everyone you touch suffers. Just talk to me! I can help you! So you can treat me like all the rest? Containing me? Suffocating me? No. I will let my genius shine on its own. I saw you, Peter, taking notes, stealing ideas, a rat in my own lab. To think I called you a friend. I am your friend, Otto! Please! I've always supported you! I always will! There it is. The Atropine! Ah! 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 Got the Atropine. Now I just need to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. You! Sorry to bust up your plans. Oh, Lance, don't worry. There's plenty of surprises left for you. We'll be seeing each other again real soon. Count on it. I need to mix the antidote. Finally, the real- <laughs> At least he had an imaginary glass jaw. Not gonna be that easy. Sure it is. Now I know you're the poison trying to distract you. Bring it on. Stand up. There's the centrifuge I need. Finally! I'm running out of time. I can feel it. I think I did it. Where? 
Where'd my suit go? I think I took decontamination a little too far. I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Let's just go ahead and forget that ever happened. Defense contracts. He was designing gear for my greatest enemies this entire time. Probably thought it was funny with me making Spider-Man's gear just next door. The neural interface is exacerbating Doc's rage. He may not be able to come back from this. He was planning this right under my nose. Was it just an idea in his head until the interface pushed him over the edge? How long was he using the device before I realized? Parker. Always listening, aren't you? Always observing, memorizing, stealing. Who have you told about the neural interface, hmm? About my work? Well, it stops here, Parker. I trusted you. But instead of recognizing my genius, what did you do? Tried to tear it down! Accused it of flaws. There are no flaws! It's a thing of beauty. A perfect extension of the mind itself into the world. Thought given form by these incredible arms. And I have only one thought on my mind now. Norman's reputation lying in tatters before me. Time to give it shape. So many good memories of working here. All tainted now. Still kind of freaky. wasn't just reinforcing the arms. He was turning them into weapons. Ooh, it's still foggy. I need to work the last of this poison out of my system before I tackle the other villains. Good time to go on patrol. Attention agents in Rosedale. This is Control. What's your status? Armored patrol on the road. Yuri, a group of escaped inmates looks like they've gotten their hands on some serious firepower. Last thing we need right now is a massive shootout on a residential street. Is it something you can handle quietly? Quietly might be pushing it, but I can do it without a massive shootout. There might be a bunch of webs around, though. I'll take it. Good luck. Nap time. Literally. 
certainly didn't see that coming. Not gonna help at your parole hearing. Where'd we get this trap? Spider-Man, I'm getting reports of shots fired. I can confirm that. They're not hitting anyone though. Try to keep it that way. Since I'm the only one they're aiming at, I am totally on board with that. Is it sad that a bunch of criminals have more loyal friends than me? Captain, the inmates and all their guns are webbed up and waiting. Thanks. No way we could have taken them without collateral damage. I hope the locals appreciate you. Okay. I need to get after Scorpion, but...
I haven't seen Aunt May face to face since the fire. I can afford a quick pit stop at Feast. question at you when is it okay to give up on a friend oh wow Pete. thinking of Otto that obvious huh yeah understandable though man the high-minded generous part of me wants to say never being a true friend means being there even when people lose their way but with what Otto's done I just don't know Pete I guess you have to decide if the Otto Octavius you knew was still in there or not Maybe if he was ever even in there at all. Yeah. Yeah. Thanks, MJ. I gotta process some stuff, I think. Call me anytime, Pete. I'm here for you. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, May? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. 
Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Need to distract him. Hacking app should work. Like a bug on a windshield. Well, I heard okay, that did stupid it. crack about the guy's suit. Frickin' got issues, <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. Through here. Guys, guys. An I ain't dying. But no antibiotics. I need to keep looking. Both of them are. But they're on our side. You two, get over here. I heard that. All right, all right, all right. This could stop right now. Just give us the locations and schedules for supply lines. I don't have that in Believe me, I hate watching Betsy Whale on Turn to my stomach. Just give us the new phone and stuff. Thought I heard. don't have clearance for that. Imagine that. Um, That's More supplies over there. Wants to hear. Need to get past these guys. Hello? Why are the super dudes so set on taking out these reliefs? Something about our in there? They want to show how weak he is and they can't protect the city. <laughs> Sounds like a lot of drama. As long as they let us keep all the supplies we find. I don't care. Yeah, man. That stuff will be worth a fortune on the black market. Come on. Let's keep digging through it. Another supply tent. A couple trauma kits. No antibiotics. Gotta be somewhere. Looks like they're gonna divvy up the supplies. Gotta avoid that sniper. Oh, boy. They better not try to short us. I heard that. Bro, relax. More supplies. Oh, come on, crate, be the one. <gasps> Mox is selling. Perfect. That is a very large man. <laughs> On the exploding bulldozer. Supply routes and schedules. Now! Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. Stop! <laughs> Not need to see that. What was that? Check it. Now. Don't think he saw me. Time to get out of here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
sword is right past him. Test my patience. Ah! Let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha, <laughs> kids right. got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. Thanks, Miles. Yuri. Figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. Up okay? I'm tired, but hanging in there. We'll get through this. Keep the faith.
Hey, MJ, what's up? You okay? I'm fine. Coming through Oscorp records. Hey, this is random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. We could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. Now it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, this adult thing is rough. But I guess the work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. In safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. There is no one my size, Hulk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, what's with the team up? Now you are alone. Means an end, Hulk. All of life is means an end. for these particular means. Freedom! True freedom! No more! No more, I know! Okay, Rhino. Let's wrap this up. Never send an eight-ton infant to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorch, love you, but you do know it's worth to cut in, right? What were you gonna do if I didn't show up? Beg him to give up? Yes, Gargan, that is exactly what I would have done. Ah, like an old married couple, you two! Octavius promise you, Scorpion! Money! Gargan has no principle! He fights for profit! Untrue! I'd like to fight a man based off for free! Play in pass! 
patty cake, you idiot! Help me! I will squash both my We could just stop now, you know. I won't tell anybody. And leave your skull uncrushed? There is fun in that! that particular lesson. Thanks. Didn't I hear you took a poetry class in the raft? Like a therapy... Along came Spider. I sat down beside him. Then crushed his tiny body to bits. That's so good. Right on stunt. I want only freedom. How can this be bad thing? How freedom I can take? Endangering all of New York to get freedom? Not so much. Do you know what Octavius will do if he finds out you failed? I failed? Yes, you freak show! A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. All right, Yuri, that's four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil threat cases are getting worse, and Oscorp is being coy about an anti-serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leaf Devil's breath to me. One of my best people is on it. Pete, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking his penthouse? That building's full of Sables, man. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple blocks away. Let me know if you get into trouble. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on the- Excuse me. The lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security suite. 
He'll never survive this. The next election, he'll get destroyed. There's the security room. But that guard will see me if I go in. Residents are pretty upset. Maybe I can rile them up to create a distraction. Oh, every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs! Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. The health emergency might do it. Really? Come on, let's go talk to security. That should do it. Crap. Jerry, get out of here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't breathe. Let me back up. Security upstairs. room's open. Just need to get to the door without being seen. Everyone, please stay calm. Sable International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. Because you run a cop. Hello. I know a few Sable agents who would love to meet you. Man, I, I set it down. Somewhere. I, I swear I swear your way out of here. We're in charge. Okay, okay, I'm gone. I like this thing. Gotta turn him around. Control, I heard something. Running a sweet. Good boy. I'm sure Sable offers work with elevator controls in the security room. Next to the Sable agent. Mary Jane Watson? Super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. Did it. Norman's clearing out, and the elevator's unlocked. Time to head upstairs. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Find the alarm technician. Fire him. Useless button. Mm. <sighs> Norman's guards have all cleared out. If he's hiding something up here, I'm going to find it. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, Sable presence downstairs just ballooned. I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with that. Keep your distance. I should be okay for now. Work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. Scientific journals debating the Spider-Man problem. <laughs> so weird there's a whole cottage industry focused on explaining Pete's powers. Weirder still that Norman is such an active part of it. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. What is this thing? Hmm. Schematics for a prototype combat mask. Looks like it can reveal structural weaknesses.
Whoa, this mask is incredible. Is it showing a door hidden in that wall? I wonder where it leads. Norman bids his the fabulous Osborne boys. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. Norman could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad code. Harry's last day. I know he left last summer, but was it just Norman locked up Harry's room? Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. But where did he put the key? Harry said his mom used to cook all the time. I'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. This room smells like... Rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. <laughs> what a hero. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Michael's for one last shot before the, um... The big trip. Uh... Hey, if you're gonna meet me there, could you grab my journal from my room? I just wanted to record some thoughts on the big Bon Voyage day. <laughs> uh, anyway, listen, I know I don't say this enough, but thank you, Dad, you know, for doing this. I love you. Wow, haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so... tired. Let's hope that journal is still here. Gotta check his room. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. God, Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. Nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. I used to be so jealous of Harry's family. They were so happy. At least compared to me and my dad. But when Emily got sick, everything changed. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. A photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. Harry's room. But it's locked. I wonder where Norman keeps the key. Harry's mom planted this when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Beautiful. Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested?
Norman's bathroom is bigger than my entire apartment. Now I feel sad. Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. Feels like there's something attached to the back of the frame. Score! This must be the key for Harry's room. What? This can't be for Harry, can it? Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. We? You are staying here. The antiserum's ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely vulnerable without me. I seem to be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep Team 2 on standby. I'm getting some air. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. July 18. Bingo. Super creepy. Gotta find the location of the Devil's Breath Lab. Spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? The labels on these cages. Bioelectrokinesis. Optical camouflage. What the hell is he trying to create? Born, GR 
R-27 research log. The whole project has gone to hell. GR-27 is a cure, not a disease. But try telling that to the evening news. Somehow, they've picked up the technician's morbid nickname, Devil's Breath, and are using it to stoke hysteria. They have no idea what it's really capable of. A cure for cancer, genetic disorders, birth defects. With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's Breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure? I almost can't believe it. scientist thing going on. What are these things? Prototype hand grenades? Wow. Norman wins the fan- Huh. This show's all a commercial building. Wow. Oscorp's going up now. Norman's not crazy enough to keep the anti serum in a shopping center. Looks like Norman's tracking Dr. Michael's movements. Creep fest. <sighs> Dr. Strom. Isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Must be out of the city. Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Wherever the anti serum is, he must have been too. Sable troop deployment. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. No. no. A records facility could be perfect cover for the good old Alpha Team. Devil's Breath Lab must have a big sable. GR-27. That's the code name for Devil's Breath. This is it. Tenth and Cathedral. Isn't that... Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. <laughs> Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27 Martin Lee incident. What is this? And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. <laughs> Where are you? Two avenues over. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. Go to alert. We're compromised. Control. Grid's clear. Repeat. Grid's clear. Turning off Lexi. 